Welcome back to the channel. Today we've got yet another 2025 M4 Competition X-Drive convertible. You're not seeing double, it's slightly different. So it's a customer ordered car in Isle of Man Green. It's a G83 chassis. And it is super hot right now in Mountain View. We're approaching 100 degrees right now. So we're gonna try to keep this as quick as possible. So up front, your new headlights with the daytime running lights. Then coring light right there. You can see shadow line lights. Then the grill, M4 competition badging in the double slat candy grill there. You can see the parking assistance camera there and driving assistance professional. And then moving over to the side, we got the style 826M wheels in black with the M compound brakes with the black calipers and probably P0s. So again, the black, to me, at least with Isle of Man Green, doesn't really make the Isle of Man Green pop. i say silver, or perhaps even the bicolor wheels in either A25 or A26Ms. And there's that side profile of the refreshed convertible. And then out back, we've got the laser tail lights. You can see X-Drive and M4 competition badging. And then silver outline on the M4. Then our standard quad exhaust and our faux diffuser in high gloss black. Here's the rest of that three quarters view out of direct sunlight. We're going to make our way inside, go over pricing options. I will not drop the top on this one here because it is really hot. Customer did not want it detailed, so it hasn't gone through the wash either, but it is done with PDI. So opening up, we have the Kalami Orange in full leather. So you can tell because the door card, Kalami Orange, upper portion door card also in leather, at least what it feels like. Then the lower dashboard is also in Kalami Orange. Then the seats, so you can see we have the neck warmers. We've got their M4 badging that lights up in the head restraint. The rest of the seats here. So pretty comfortable seat, well bolstered. Then we've got adjustments here for side bolster and lumbar support and a manually powered crumb catcher. M4 badging on the door sill. So please excuse the air blasting. The car's been sitting out for a little bit. So you got your standard M steering wheel with M badging and this flat bottom as well. Carbon fiber interior trim means you've got the carbon fiber insert here. On the left hand side, you got the driving assistance professional package buttons. Then M1, M2 buttons in red carbon fiber shift pedals, and then you see iDrive 8.5, the M version in M mode road, and heads up display, can't forget to mention the 12 o'clock stripe here on the steering wheel, the rest of the curved display here, and more carbon fiber trim, and the revised vents with the nipples to adjust the opening and closing and positioning of those vents, more carbon fiber trim on the center console, Got your gear select with the embossed M emblem, as well as M stitching. Red start stop button and our iDrive controller. All right, so starting price of the 2025 M4 Competition X Drive is 95,300 bucks. The metallic paint adds another 650. Kalami orange full leather another 2550. Driving Assistance Pro for 1700, and parking assistance pack for another 700. The exec package for another 1250. 300 bucks for the shadow line lights and then carbon fiber trim for another 950. Neck warmer for another 650. And 500 bucks for front ventilated seats. And another 100 bucks for the drive recorder. All told, MSRP of this particular example is 105,825 bucks. And you'll note the destination charge has increased to 1175. So it's up a little bit, but it's been 990 ish for quite some time bound to happen eventually, but still, compared to other manufacturers, probably not a bad deal. 
All right, we're gonna try and hopping in the back seat with the roof up or top up. All right, so you have room for two more passengers in the back. All right, and here's a view of the cockpit to the back seat. You can see that full leather really makes a nice appearance here. So it's the standard color that you get, not standard, but sort of like the uh, launch color. So Kalami orange interior, Isle of Man green exterior. Then you got vents back here, no climate control zone and, and no USB charging ports. Knee room and leg room can be a little bit on the difficult side. And for the convertible, it's not too bad with the top up. I think the bigger complaint is how the passengers are shunted more towards the center of the car, meaning rear passengers don't have a lot of shoulder room. All right, make our way to the back and take a look at the cargo area. So there's no kick to open. So here's your cargo area, which you'd expect with a convertible. So that partition has to be down in order to move the uh, top up and down. That little lever right there gets you access to the wind deflector should you need it. Right, let's close that up. We'll make our way to the hood and take a look at what's under the bonnet. All right, so here's the S58 inline six three liter twin turbo engine, 523 horsepower, 479 torques. So a slight increase in horsepower for the X-Drive models. But that's it for a quick tour around our second M4 convertible. Also the second one is an Isle of Man Green. We'll see you at the next video.